For RJ, I guess, what were you what were you guys feeling when Champagne hits that three at the end of regulation, and and how much more uh, I guess of an exhale was it in overtime once you got that big lead? Um, I mean, for me personally, I mean, I was the one guarding him when he made that shot, so like it was tough for me. I'm just like, dang, like that was a tough shot. Um, but once we got the opportunity, you know, to to force the overtime, I knew it was from there it was just up. You know, five minutes of us giving us a chance to come and win a game. I have the utmost confidence in us every time. Um, so I'm just happy we were able to uh, close the win, close it out, and, and, and win the game. Adama, what's the – to your right. Yeah. Hey. Uh, what's the feeling like going to the line with one second left and a game on the line? It felt good. You know, uh, before the shot, I was a little bit nervous, but I was like, uh, uh, two shot. I just need to make one so we can go. So we're going to go over time again. So it was pretty good, you know. Because that shot, I think that shot was for me to take it. Yeah. So pretty good. Yeah. Yeah. I got nervous. Adama, what, what's the last month been like for you to have to sit out and heal? And, and work in whatever way you were able to, to get back to the point where you could play 30 plus minutes and then 40 tonight, it seems like you're fully back. Yeah, I'm, I'm very happy to, like, to be able to play 40 minutes without no pain. Last month, like, last couple of weeks was not easy, you know, be able, not be able to like practice, uh, you know, not be able to work out, just watching practice you now, and come back from uh, a bad injury, be able to play 40 minutes right away, 35 minutes right away. It feels great. We, uh, be able to play 40 minutes right away without pain, without nothing. It feels great. Yeah. It's not, it was not. It was tough. Because uh, the game against Singer, I was not supposed to play like 30, 25 minutes, you know. But uh, keep, when I was in the game, they keep asking me, you good? I was like, yeah, I'm good. I'm not feeling no pain. And, you know, so it feels good to be like 100% right now. Yeah. And I think I'm 100%. Yeah. RJ, how, how important was it to win this game? You've had some close losses, and just for your, your team's confidence and to pull out a game like this, how, how much of a boost does it give you? I mean, <clears throat> it was very important um, just to get back into the win column and just have a different uh, spirit around the, the whole uh, program right now. Um, it's been tough, you know, walking walking away with, with uh, L's in these, in these close games, but it's just a learning, it's just a learning uh, curve for us, you know, just keep taking the things that we need to necessary to, that are necessary for us to win these these close games uh, to to finish them out, and I think uh, we're we're taking the right steps right now. You guys both went into the uh, you know into the overtime you know collapsed a little bit at the end, but you guys went on a nice fifteen five run in overtime. What was the the feeling like going uh, you know into overtime and at the end of overtime? Honestly, I I feel like going into overtime was like a breath of fresh air. It was just another opportunity for us to another basketball game, you know, five minute basketball game, small war. Um, and we had to, you know, close it out. Um, I felt like we knew that we were it was just going to be a tough overtime war, but you know, we were we're talented enough to to pull these games out. Uh, Adama, coach talked about how you're you're kind of a confident guy. Where does that kind of come from? Say that again. Coach talked about you being a confident guy. Yeah. Where does your confidence come from? Uh, from being gym every day, cause. Uh, I've been in gym every day, and I know when I'm in game, I know I just need to, like, go at people. So I'm confident to, like, because I've not been in gym every day working on, working on my uh, game. So every time I'm in game, I'm confident to play against anybody because I know I work on stuff that doing the game. Yeah. Uh, RJ, can you just talk about what a difference Adama makes to the team. He, he just seems like he puts everybody else back in their correct role where they should be when he's back and playing well. <clears throat> um, yeah, I mean, Adama's big time. Um, he's huge for us, you know, offensively and defensively. Tonight is a prime example of what he did for us on both ends of the floor. Um, and just being able to play off of him because everyone, you know, Adama's going to get the ball. So everybody knows that, and just being able when they double him, and everybody being able to cut and just play off of him, it makes everyone's life easier, um, and I'm sure it makes his life easier. So he doesn't have to do everything.